So I'm Marcus, I'm here with Noise Engineering at Synthflex and we're showing off five new modules. Okay, so five modules. We got uh, Sync Bucina. It's basically a low-pass gate. Um, if you send trigger into the ping input, you basically just have normal low-pass gate behavior. You have just full release time. Um, it's all analog, but it doesn't use backdrills. So uh, your release is about 200 milliseconds all the way up to around eight seconds. Um, so it's really, really uh, diverse in what you can do with it. Um, the ping is also velocity dependent, basically. So if you um, send a lower or higher voltage trigger into it, you get different kind of results. It's very dynamic. Um, the gate in is basically a slew. So if you put a gate into it, you get an ASR envelope. Uh, but you can also send just normal voltage in, uh, adjustable rise and fall times. Um, you have two filter slopes. So you have a 12 dB low pass and a uh, resonant 6 dB low pass, as well as a VCA mode that just bypasses the uh, filter completely. Moving on, we have Torsi Arena. Um, it's three analog distortion circuits. They're routed in series, but they're addressable separately as well. Uh, you basically have two different flavors of drive and then a fuzz. Uh, we just announced uh, Kith Arena. It's another one of our distortion series. Uh, it's basically a EQ and drive. Again, addressable separately, all analog. Um, you have a high cut and boost, low cut and boost, and a mid switch. Uh, sounds really nice. The EQ is really clean, uh, but the drive really brings some character into it. Um, let's see. Cursus and Teratos Procedo. This is kind of our big announcement. Uh, this was announced back at NAMM. Uh, so we took the Cursus and Teratos sound engine uh, and gave it basically the Procedo treatment. So it has a VCA and an envelope similar to the Localica Teratos Procedo. Um, the envelope can be routed to all the different per parameters via these attenuverters. Um, the attenuverters then go through the Master Blaster, which is basically an attenuverter over those envelope sends. It's designed as kind of a performance macro. Uh, that is also tied to a 0 to 5 volt CV offset, uh, so you can tie this into the rest of your patch. Um, it's extremely deep. There's a lot you can do with it with all the CV inputs as well. Uh, the last thing we just announced yesterday was uh, Vox Digitalis, which is basically a 1 to 16 step CV sequencer uh, designed for pitch. It has about a 4 octave range. Um, basically, you can uh, dial in the length of the sequence you want. So right now it's on a 10 step sequence. Uh, and then you just type in the notes you want with the advance and the encoder. It's designed to be super immediate, uh, super easy to use and small, so good for smaller systems. Um, it can save uh, up to 16 patterns as well. So it's pretty versatile, uh, designed just to be straightforward basically. Uh, so those are all of our new modules. Um, TR, Syncbacina, and uh, Cursus and Teratos Procedo are all up for pre-order right now.